Greetings, all you wonderful people. I am Jeff the Christian Gamer, and I am centering my camera. And then I'm going to tell you guys about a fun issue that I just experienced with the new update, update 3.0, with uh, the Joy Cons. My left Joy Con, for some reason, decided that it want to wanted to completely disconnect and be unrecognizable by my system. Um, at first, I thought this was a charging issue, but it is not. Uh, yeah, give me a second, I'm going to get uncomfortably close while I grab my switch here. Um, basically, uh, during the system update for some reason, in my console, um, during the system update, uh, if maybe there's some sort of issue with it that the Joy-Cons randomly disconnect or, or, or unrecognizable. Anyway, um, this guy would not respond at all. It, uh, you know how it has these lights? Uh oh, oh, those lights right there to tell you that it's, uh, that it's sinking or trying to sink. It would not put those lights up. Uh, it would not, uh, be recognized by the system in any way, shape, or form. It would not charge. Uh, in fact, there was a logo that, let me see if I can show you guys. Uh, under controller. If you go to uh, controllers and then you look for uh, the controller to be connected, uh, you will see this message. Oh my goodness. You will see this message. Such a reflective screen. Uh, let me. Uh, there we go. But yeah, uh, good grief. There it is. Okay, you'd see this, and your Joy Con is both grayed out and separated from the controller, that means that the controller is uh, not recognized, it's not synced. So what you need to do in order to do that, uh, to get it synced again, uh, instead of taking your controller back, because I was really tempted to do that, uh, you want to go ahead and uh, take your left Joy-Con, and there's a button right, uh -oh, button right there that I'm pointing to right now. You hold that button in for one second, and this bad boy will start flashing up and down, like this number right here. As soon as it starts doing that, you connect it properly, and you'll hear that, uh, that switch noise, that snapping, and that will tell you that it is actually properly synced again. And then when you look at your console, like so, it will show, oh my goodness, oh, uh, it will show that both of your joy cons are connected again and uh, that it well if I had it connected that it would say that it was charging so I would suggest trying this first before you guys uh, start freaking out and go and return your joy cons and say things like oh Nintendo is uh, messed up or some kind of something like that because it's not true uh, I even had a little Twitter post oh there it goes uh, oh Beauty and the Beast downloaded Hmm. Yeah. Um. Anyway, so in case you have issues with uh, your Joy-Con and uh, oh yeah, side note: if you notice that I'm scratching my nose a lot, it is because allergies. I have a bunch of really random symptoms. My eyes will water up, my nose will itch, or my throat will get incomprehensibly dry, and I will cough a lot. And all of those are annoying and terrible, and I apologize, but. This is the uh, nature of the beast here in Colorado. They have a lot of weird pollens that I haven't been exposed to before. Anyway, uh, point of the matter, uh, you can resync your controller to get it to charge again in the event that it stops charging after the system update 3.0.0, which came out today, June 20th, uh, I believe at like 12.01 or some kind of madness like that. But anyway, yeah, that's the fix that I found for it. If it does not sync again, then it probably means you do have a defective Joy-Con, but um, yeah, I just wanted to post this video so you guys would know uh, not to return your limited edition neon yellow Joy-Cons if you didn't actually need to because that would suck if you had to go and give them back and they didn't have the right color like I was about to do. I was just about to take them back in and uh, yeah, essentially they said, yeah, we don't have any more of those and I'm like, mm. Yeah, let me go ahead and see if I can't troubleshoot this bad boy. Was able to successfully troubleshoot it after contacting Nintendo. 
they had a couple of troubleshooting steps and we went through a couple of different uh, methods and we finally got that bad boy fixed but that was the solution that we found so um, yeah thank you guys very much for watching I am Jeff the Christian Gamer if you'd like to like and or subscribe you may do so by clicking on the links uh, provided also if you'd like to check out other videos that I've done you may do so by clicking on the links in the video will be right there and then right there yeah so yeah thank you very much again and uh, have a wonderful day happy uh, switching